Brabham has to hit it wide open because Sheldon Creed, he's not going to lift. He won't. He's going to hit it wide open. Look how and then high look at, above oh, the fence it is. Wow. Maddie Brabs right there. That's a postcard. I'm sending that home to the family. Welcome to the Gold Coast. Oh, it's hit the chassis at the front as well. Oh, and sparks <laughs> are flying. From Maddie Brabham. Maddie Brabham. Unbelievable. I can hear the horn from the Dukes of Hazard show right now. Oh, look at his neck. Oh. oh. I, I, I have seen every single lap of practice, qualifying, testing, racing of this series since day number one. I have never, ever seen a landing like that. We talked about this yesterday, didn't we? That there could be some rollovers, but not on the parade lap. I would have guaranteed that there was going to be rollovers. I did not know it was going to be happening on the parade lap. I'm not sure who that is. As you see him coming out, it looks like oh, he's it is Charles Dorrance. Has he ridden that curb too hard down there at turn nine? I've got good news for you, though. These trucks are tough. Uh, or maybe a uh, misjudgment of Sarah's speed by Paul. He's struggling to pull that truck up. Yeah, he really was. What do you think of that? Yeah, I, I, that's like you out on the field. This is Brabham going down off the beach. He was out of control, spun. The wall straightened him out. And what's the dude arrive on the scene here? Bang! Ah. From Matty Mingate. Arrived on the scene with nowhere to go as well. Nowhere to oh. go, but Brabham was backing up. So down into the chicane, was he just got the edge, he backed it in, it just tripped him up. Oh, oh you hooked it on the... Oh. oh, that's embarrassing, he'll hate that. Oh, boy. So he got that... away with it, he just clipped himself on the way out. Ran, running in, all on his own, and no, Don just didn't help it. So out in there all by himself, landed on all fours but then climbed back up on the tires, it looks, on his exit. He's like, boom, here I am, parked, up on two. Wait, no, I'm good, and I'm out. Oh, I'm wrong, I'm bad, I'm bad. <laughs> the, the, when they come down, they're almost hitting it. Look at Dee Dee. Dee Dee gets into the wall all on his own. The 441 driver got out in front there, made that pass for the lead, not able to hang on to it. Bill Hines back out in front. In trouble getting it turned. Oh, almost oh. three abreast, and up on the wall no, goes no. Keegan Kincaid. Oh, the... and then into Gordon. He makes contact with Gordon. Wow, and BJ Baldwin and Kincaid come together. Can you believe what you're seeing? This will be more damning down here in the turn number one. So Gordon gets it to the inside to make it two wide, but Davis is already locked up, hits the wall. Jones nowhere to go. Yeah, Jones is out of room right there. He definitely parked Davis there, but Davis came in. A little bit of understeer there. It's, here's another good look at it. Davis comes in, always evolving truck. About ready to go over. He looked like he may have gotten over it on his own, but he had to get on the brakes a little bit there, which brought P.J. Jones into the mix as well. So uh, hard to say exactly what happened there. So we're on board right now. P.J. Jones goes to the inside. He's already got his hands up in the air like there's an issue. Not sure what that issue is other than uh, to keep the speeds down on that jump. We try not to jump him over 70, 80 miles per hour. Here's the replay. Oh, there he goes. He just oh. nudged it and he got the, got the box set going through. He's moved him out of the way. Good thing they're not full of water as they normally would be for roadworks. P.J. Jones down the inside of Lion Dyke Jr. They've made contact down here. Uh, and Jones gets into Lion Dyke. Oh, oh, and Bill Hines and Hoffman, they all get collected in there. That is right where the dirt gets dragged out. There's a little bit of dust on the asphalt, makes it extremely slippery. Not the gentleman he was yesterday, but that was a good pass. As your winner, Keegan Kincaid. Oh, no! He's gone and rolls into the fence just over the finish line and keeps it going. There you go, Sheldon Creed, the showstopper. We had an event down on Mitchell Street. We had a truck on display. When we were finished up, there was two security guards there. I asked them, hey, think I can flip a couple doughies? They said, I don't care. If I would have thought it was, I was gonna be here today um, and a truck being impounded for 48 hours, I obviously wouldn't have done it.